Hey, this is Eric, and this video is one in a series of videos on Google Chrome. In this video, we're looking at creating and using bookmark folders in Chrome. In a previous video, we looked at one trick for managing your bookmarks, which was using bookmark icons. This is a great way to save space on the bookmark bar for your most commonly visited sites. However, that probably won't solve all of your issues if you have dozens or hundreds of bookmarks. Another helpful tip is to use bookmark folders. Let's take a look at how to create bookmark folders, how to add favorites to the folders, and how to search through all of your bookmarks. So if you have a lot of bookmarks that fit into a category, one option for organizing them and saving space is to put them into a folder. So for example, let's say I have a lot of bookmarks for resources related to a Jamboard session that I'm going to be teaching. I could put all of these Jamboard bookmarks into one folder called Jamboard, for example. Here's how to do that. First, we'll just right click on any empty spot on the bookmarks bar and then choose Add Folder from the pop-up menu. This will open the new folder window. Here we can type in the name that we want for our folder and then click save when done. This will put the new folder on our bookmarks bar. Now we can click and drag that folder around to put it where we would like on the bookmarks bar. Now that we have the folder, it is super easy to add bookmarks to it. For our existing bookmarks, we simply click and drag to drop them into the folder. Let's go ahead and do that for each of these bookmarks. And if we come across another resource that needs to get bookmarked into the same folder, Instead of clicking on the normal star icon to favorite it or to bookmark it up in the top address bar, there's an easier option. What you do is you click on the link one time to select it, then you click on it again and hold down. Now while holding down on the link, drag it to the bookmarks folder and drop it into the folder. And there we go. Now we can just click on the folder anytime we want to access any of the bookmarks that are nicely organized inside of it. However, in addition to opening just a single bookmark, we can actually open the entire folder all at once. For example, I may want to open all the Jamboard links when I'm getting ready to start my training. Now, to do this, simply right-click on the folder and then choose the option to open all. All of the bookmarked links from the folder will now open up one link per tab. Even with all this organization, you may still get to the point that you have so many folders and so many bookmarks that it's still difficult to find the one that you need. Thankfully, Chrome provides a built-in bookmark search. Now, there's a number of ways to get to this, but an easy way to access it is to do the following. First, click up in the address bar at the top and type in the at symbol. This will create a drop-down menu where you can select search bookmarks. Now, just type in the word or words that you want to search for. The drop-down list will now show you any of your bookmarks that match that search for you to click on and open. This is a quick and easy way to find the bookmark you need. And that's it! Folders are a great way to organize your bookmarks, save space, and access all of your links quickly and easily. Be sure to check out the other blog posts and videos in my series on Google Chrome to pick up more tips and helpful ideas. And for all the rest of my educational technology resources, be sure to visit my site at controlaltachieve.com, follow me on Twitter, subscribe to my YouTube channel, sign up for my email newsletter, and check out my book, Control Alt Achieve, 
rebooting your classroom with creative Google projects. Thanks so much and take care.